five more days until Teen Wolf Season 5 airs on MTV on June 29th. What's up you guys, Jasmine here, welcome to another Teen Wolf Tuesday here on my channel. I know I've gotten into the ugly habit of talking and sharing my opinion on stupid things, oh my gosh, about things in the Teen Wolf fandom and a bunch of other stuff like that. And today I'm going to be doing the same thing, but I'm going to be giving you facts about Teen Wolf that you probably already knew about, but I don't care, and I'm going to try to do all of them in the least amount of time possible. So here we go. Holland Roden actually originally auditioned for the character of Allison Argent, believe it or not. And apparently, Dylan O'Brien actually auditioned to be Scott and not Styles. You know when our favorite banshee Lydia Martin screams? Yeah, well, those are fake, and they've been fake for a while now. If it wasn't for the beautiful Crystal Reed and her enthusiasm and love for the character that is Allison Argent, the line, I love you Scott McCall or whatever it was at the, during her death, it would have never happened if it wasn't for her because that wasn't even in the script. She pushed for that to happen, so thank you Crystal Reed. According to my Team of Season 1 DVD commentary, Jeff Davis was originally kind of iffy about casting Crystal Reed as Allison because he was afraid that her and Tyler Posey looked too much alike, that they could practically be brother and sister. The first two seasons of Teen Wolf were filmed in Atlanta, Georgia, my home state, apparently. Not even really my home state, the state I was born in, because I didn't live there for that long, but this isn't about me. But then, for the following seasons, three, four, and five, if you don't know how to count, were filmed in the beautiful and sunny Los Angeles, California, and other various places around the state of California, I'm assuming, because, you know, not everything can be done on a set. Dylan O'Brien's resume for his audition for Styles was two YouTube links. How great is that? If you don't know this next fact, well then I'm sorry to say this, but you're not that very smart. And that wasn't proper English, so I guess I'm not that smart either. MTV's Team Wolf is based off of the 1985 Michael J. Fox film called Teen Wolf. Here's a fact that everybody should know by now. The timeline of Teen Wolf is actually pretty messed up, seeing that the show Apparently, I'm guessing the first season was supposed to be 2010, which is when they started filming, and then like season two is still 2010, maybe it's like 2011-ish, I don't know, and then like, I don't know, who knows what year it is in Team Wolf, I don't, but that's a fact that the timeline is messed up, Jeff Davis, please fix it. I don't know if anybody else knew this, but Danny Mahialani's last name Mahialani stands for full moon in Hawaiian. If that's not symbolism, I don't know what is. Or would that be like an illusion? I'm not very good in English, or anything. Tyler Posey's dad has starred in a few episodes of Teen Wolf. I'm not sure if this one's a fact, but apparently there was an alternative ending-ish thing, I think in 211 or 212, where Isaac Leahy was supposed to die. So that's pretty tragic, but it's great because he lived and he didn't die. That's literally all the facts that I have about Teen Wolf because, you know, my brain doesn't process that much. So I could have known some facts like a while ago, but I don't know them now. So that's literally it. For this week's Teen Wolf Tuesday, 60 second rant. I need to open my little thing. My, my thing. Yeah. I am going to be ranting about the ugly thing that still exists. I don't understand why. But it's called... Ship Hate. Okay. First of all, homies... Ship hate is not a cool thing. I used to do it all the time. I don't understand why I did it, but I did, and I regret it. My dogs are barking. I apologize for that, but it's not cool. It's okay if you don't ship something, but to go to someone who does, in fact, ship that ship that you don't like and complain to them about that ship and bash their ship, saying that it's stupid, it's never going to happen, yada, 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 it's ridiculous, okay? It's crazy to see, like, people coming at Steric shippers because the chances of Steric happening are slim to none, and then, like... Them getting mad, the same people who came at Steric Shippers, getting mad when someone tells them that Stiddy isn't going to happen. Or, I don't know, some weird ship like, I don't, I don't know, Peter and Siles is never going to happen. I don't know, it's just, it doesn't make sense. It's a vicious, ugly cycle and it just needs to be stopped. How about we just let everybody ship whatever they want to ship, okay? Unless it's like something that's really never going to happen, like Mr. Harris and like, I don't, I don't know, like, Melissa McCall. That'd be weird because Harris is dead, for one, and, yeah, that was a terrible rant. But it's okay, because the point is, ship hate is ugly, it's not cool, I mean, you have the right to do whatever you want, and if you want to hate a ship, that's fine, but don't go to a shipper to bash their ship, and call them names for shipping something that you don't like. 
that's all for this week's video. Tell me down below in the comments any facts you know about Teen Wolf, whether it's the cast or characters or production, anything like that. Tell me down below in the comments. Don't forget to give this video a big ol' thumbs up for me, including because we're close to the Season 5 uh, premiere, and that's a reason to fave this video, or like it, thumbs up it, whatever you want to call it, that's a reason to do so, because we're closer and closer to Season 5. Finally, do not forget to subscribe to my channel for two new videos every single week, every Tuesday and every Saturday. That's all for this week's video. Until Saturday, peace out and have a lovely week. If I die, baby, lay me down on the